Welcome back to Rebellion Gaia. Last time we went through Jekyll Island and Monsanto Corp and are about to head to Liberland. Oh, and we got an amazing Terminator suit that, as you can see, I do not have on me right now because I actually loaded up an older save file. I actually, I have, I had all my save files backed up in one, one drive, so I had to look at, look at file history and, you know, find an older one because the ones that I currently had did not have it back. But if you remember in the sewer, I believe his name was Chaps. He wanted a sample of the uh, purple Monsanto Akasa water so he could neutralize it in some sort of way. And I, I look back at, at the video of that and he said he wanted it from the town, which is right up north here. I can't really go up north there, but we, we, we can't actually go up there. Well, I was just exploring around and I ended up finding this. You, you, you see this ladder here. I climbed that down the ladder. It doesn't do anything. You actually have, you can actually climb up the ladder. I had no idea. No idea you could do this. Whoa, the view is great from up here. So yeah, we, we can get like a brief uh, look at the uh, port area, which we should have done this way earlier, but I had no idea because there was no clear indication. But, oh well. It is what it is, right? It is what it is. And we also go down here, see some of the Monsanto stuff. Oh my, there's so much of it. What is in all of those barrels? Akasa is what's keeping the lights on in a city like this. It's what powers all the tech. It's what would have powered the Vimama that you flew here on. It is It is what's killing Gaia. The Nadox said the only reason the Wastelands exist is because of this stuff. Wasteland. You say that like it's a it's rare. You grew up with far too much green, Dragon Slayer, and it shows. Most of Gaia is a wasteland. So yeah, we can get a little look at, at that stuff. But also, more importantly, right here, again, like, how would you find the ladder to begin with? And then you also have to come up to this point, hit the button here, use rope to climb across the Monsanto Corp. I mean, how are you supposed to know to, know to do that? I don't know how I figured it out, but there you go. We got the Akasa sample. And then if we take that back to Chaps, um, let's see what he says. And it's a shame that I missed this on my main file. Oops. But, uh, yeah. Oh, well. Let's see what he ends up gi giving us as, as a result. Chaps, we got the sample from Monsanto Corp. You wanted... Great work. With this original sample, I can work on a way to neutralize it. Here, take these potions. They will help you on your journey. Two power increases. So we end up getting... Yeah, increase your attack by three points. Really, really cool. But again, I cannot use it. And he says, it won't be long until I can make a neutralizing agent to the, to the spent Akasa in the water. So, I don't really know exactly what that means, like how long it would take him to do it. Is it by game time? Is it based on a certain event that happens in the game and then you, you get something and what do you end up getting? Do you get something that maybe you can walk across the Akasa without getting damaged or hurt or poisoned or, you know, stuff like that? I don't, I don't really know. I don't really know and I guess we really will not know because that's not my main file. That's not my main file. Let's just go ahead and load up my main, main file. Anyway, so here I am, the main, main file, and I actually forgot to come up here in Monsanto Corp building, so let's go ahead and do that. Please take what you want from the facility, but leave the employees alone. Hmm. Well, we got, we got a blast in. We won't let you hurt Gaia anymore. Okay, so we have some fools here. We got some idiots that need to be neutralized, shall we say. Uh, let's do slash, there we go. And you also do slash. Attack them all and just get rid of them. Get rid of these fools. If they're working for Monsanto Corp, they must go.
There you go. There you go, Terminator man. Get rid of all of them with your extremely... Extremely, uh, loud, loud attack. Yeah, I'm not too worried about your attacks anymore, sir. I really am not. I mean, some of them are a little bit strong, especially on Lucy. Please stop attacking Lu Lucy. You're still alive, man? You're still freaking alive. Okay, this is a problem, sir. You gotta go now, man. Get gone. You're still alive. How this how, how these guys still alive after after all that? Please stop attacking Lucy. Go on then. They gotta be dying soon. Come on, man. Lucy, just just hold on for a little bit longer. Do not kill Lucy. Whatever it is that uh, that you do. Okay. Please, Lucy, kill him off. Oh, okay, two, two of them are dead. Okay, let's just do no a normal attacks. So that should end them all, hopefully. Okay, thank goodness. Okay, blast around. Thank you. What did it say? Blast around something. I kind of skipped past it. Um. Oh, because I already have a max. Okay. Okay, so finally, we get it, we get to go up here. Okay, so save it. Please have mercy. Let the employees free. Who are you? I am Bill Sussman. I run this facility. K Kill and rob. 500 gold take. <laughs> Look at his dead body. Kill and rob. So yeah, we, we can just kill them all and rob them. I'm not going to do that. We got to be a nice person. Th these are innocent victims. Of Monsanto Corp. Let the employees free. Okay, you are all free to leave. Go and find a meaningful way to spend your time. Yeah, we don't want to kill him. And we end up getting 600 gold. So yeah, we could have gotten a lot more money if we killed them all, but... Anyway, so yes. Okay, so that's all done. So I guess now... Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go out the main entrance. It would just be easier, quicker that way. There we go. Fantastic. Okay, so I guess we're gonna be heading to Liberland now. We have the Liberland Passport. That, uh, I guess we better heal up first. There we go. So, Liberland. Okay, so this is what's really interesting about Liberland. So, it's very easy to get in. I mean, look how easy it was for us to get into Li uh, Liberland. Let me tell you this. The real Liberland, I was watching some videos this past week. No one lives there. You can't even get to it without the uh, police, you know, like, arresting you, basically. Who, because... L Liber, a Libra land is between two countries. It's like a little area of land that none of the countries have claimed yet. So it's really just an uninhabited area. But there's a lot of people who live on I don't know what's what side of the country that it's that it's on um, because I, I forget the two countries that it's near. But um, yeah, it is. That there are some people who kind of make like a little village and kind of have the dream of what Liberland is me me meant to be, which is supposed to be a place of freedom. And you use like cryptocurrency to buy stuff and all that sort of stuff. It's it's a really fascinating. And I watched some, as I said, I watched some videos of people trying to get to it and you just can't, you just can't. So the fact that we have made it here so easily is like a blessing, it really is. Anyway, not all welcome. Do you have a Liberland passport? Uh, yes, sir, here we go, come on in. Go on, then. Welcome to Liberland. We live by natural law. No rules, no slaves, no empire. If only it was this easy to get into the real one. So you have, uh, Monsanto Corp? No, those are Monsanto Corp people. Terminator guys. 
Yeah, let's go ahead and save game. So we have to go through the checkpoint first, it looks like. And then we get onto a boat. Oh, listen to that music. A little spooky. Okay, let's uh, look around see if there's anything we can actually do here before we actually go into the main area. I see there's some helicopters over there, some planes, some helicopters. I wonder how much money they cost to buy, because we're, we're going to need to get one. Alright, head into the land, finally. Oh, is this the thing that I use my anarchy symbols? You have 68 freedom rings. Pass halfway. Well, duh. Hopefully I can use them to, to, uh, to get, get stuff. Welcome to Liberland. You are free to be yourself here without the limiting belief that your empire has put upon us all. Thank you, sir. No, sir. This is the shrine to the gold to the god of freedom, Lord Anarchy. Yeah, we have <laughs> we got plenty of those. We got 68 out of 108. We have 40 left in the entire game. That's exciting. Really exciting. Libra Lane rules. Don't steal. This includes life, trust, and time. That's it. That's the only rule. Hey, kids. I got an Imperial code book. So you can pass Imperial Naval Checkpoint. Sir, I already have one of those. I already have one of those. I got it from West, Westminster Castle. 3,000 gold and it's yours. Uh, no. Are we just going to have, like, like a second one? Let me, uh... Oh, we got the Broken Blaster. That's what it was. Imperial Neighbor Code Book. Okay, let's, let's see if we do end up getting a second one. I'm going to save it, and I'm not going to waste my gold. Let's see. It, it counts as two. Okay. Sir, I am buying that crap. already have one. <laughs> already got one, one, one for free. The hemp we grow out here protects us from the radiation, while the radiation protects us from the Empire. That makes perfect sense, actually. Sacred cannabis oil. We already have some of those. Although the description for it is wrong. Um, I'll get a, a, th a few more of those. Old and Life Spice. I'll get five, five more of those. Just so we can have on hand. A little bit more of that. Tent, rope. I already have eight of those. I'll, I'll, I'll get ten. Just so I have them on hand. Okay. Dragon Breastplate. I'm pretty sure we already have something like, like that. Um, yeah, that's that's weaker. That is de de definitely one problem with this game because it's like it's hard to tell where you go next. That's not story related or if things can be closed off and like some of the stuff that I showed you with the Monsanto Corp building in Vanguard. It's just like how are you supposed to know? How are you supposed to know? This is our voluntary legal system. It's if somebody steals in Liberland, the security guard brings them here to Lord Karma. Wow, I like that. If you are not willing to sit with Karma, then you are banished from Liberland. Oh, I like that a lot. Max will be in the inn. Yes, we're looking for, for Max. If the rebels lose the war, then we must have to rejoin the Empire. Uh, I really hope not. Let me just keep uh, talking to people here first. Don't even bother going inside if you haven't the coins to get... Coins to get... Back it up. Coins to back it up. Okay, is that is that the end? I think that might actually be the end. So let me say first, I think this is like an armor shop. I ho oh, it's a furry. A furry. The furries live on Liberland. Okay, that's uh, I guess that makes sense because no actual human can land on Liberland without getting arrested, but the animals can go as they please. You know, you got birds go on there. You got furries. Like I'm a, fur I identify as a furry, so you can go to Liberland. I hope that human younglings put all their books and maps back in the right order. Is that all you gotta say? Brief history of Gaia. I'm pretty sure we already read this. Actually... I don't think that we did, actually. 
accurate recorded history on Gaia goes back only 2,114 years. The people of Gaia are a species with willful amnesia. Okay, that's starting to sound a little bit familiar now. But yes, okay, so yes, I think we actually have read this one before. Numerous discoveries, old and tech. Okay. A severe calamity is believed to have ended the end set ancients over 10,000 years ago. Dragons. Okay. I believe that we, we did read that. Creatures from Jekyll Island. I know that we definitely read that one. Okay, what is this? What is this? So there's a... I want to say... Where we are now... We're not... Lever Land, I think, is that red spot up in the top center area. Or maybe not. I don't know how this is positioned exactly. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what that is, huh? I'm looking for treasure, Outlander. What if this is, like, treasure related? It looks like there might be something treasure related. The Ancient Arcs. Okay, I know that we haven't have not read this. During a time of great cataclysm, an ancient built arcs across Gaia and cavernous deep below the Earth. These are- oh wait. All forms of life repopulate the planet in the event of a cataclysm. It is believed that the Odins were those who survived within these arcs. Seven arcs were recorded to have been built by the ancients, yet only six myths, stories, and legends from the descendants. The lost arc was known as Vault 7. Thousands of ancients, including their ancient king, known as Mr. Mr. D, were lost forever inside after the great demon destroyed it. The Knights of Sidonia believed they were the descendants of Vault 7 and that their brethren were killed by the Ark by a demon. Don't we have something? Let me look. Okay, no, I thought this was from Sidonia or something. Okay. The Temple of the Sun. Home of the Shimantaka Blade. The Great Ayapo Forest. These are definitely interesting. The myth- okay, we've definitely read- I've read that. Okay, this is the map. We already have that. It looks like it was pointing maybe up to like Vanguard, possibly? Hmm. Interesting. Pretty sure that we re read this one too, right? The Archons. The the Archons have bodies that are both male and female and faces that are the faces of beasts. Thus, they are not truly male nor female nor human or animal. Yeah, I believe that we uh, read, read that one. Interesting. Uprising of 67. I know that we definitely read that. Oh, I always like when I can do, do that one. Legend of the Shimantaka Warriors. I know that we read that one. Treasure map. This is a treasure map. This is for sure a treasure map. Okay. So we need a long, funky looking island. With like, okay, let's see. Bottom, bottom right. There it is. Bottom right, okay. And it wants us to go all the way along there, down towards where we can't do anymore. Okay, we will remember that. We'll remember that. I bet you there's something good, good there. The people's assembly meeting isn't for a few weeks. We are not here for the meeting. We are looking for Max the Egan. Oh, Max, Max Egan. Very well, Lander. He is up at the inn. Uh, I always like when I can do do that. You can do this far too often in this game. Oh wait, this is a, there's a kitty cat up here. Hey kitty, can I interact with you? No? Be nice if I could. Kitty cat? Cute little kitty. Anyway, move along, sir. Ch uh, chosen, chosen butt. Let's go get that army. Chosen butt? <laughs> Shut up, you pair of ding-dongs. 
It's all, it all makes sense now. What are you talking, what, what are you guys talking about? This is being weird. Behold the god of law and order, Lord Karma. Face Karma? Go ahead. Two power, oh my gosh. Karma. Two power increase potions, two life increase potions, and 7,777 gold. And full, a full heal. Okay, so power, life increase, increase max HP. Lucy definitely needs that for, for sure. Increase power. Who needs like the most power? I want to say it's probably Rudy. That's amazing. 172, 111, 169. Okay, no, looks like it's. I'll split it between Sig and Dan, Dan, Dan Dix. There. Because Lucy doesn't doesn't do tax. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna save again. Let's see what happens if we face Karma again. Nothing, okay. Don't hurt anyone, and you will be left to do anything else here. You will be left to do anything else here. Who pays you to stand there? The local business council pool gold together. Peace is good for business, so it's in their interest. Oh, this is this is the end. Hey kids, I got an Imperial code book. You can pass Imperial Naval check Checkpoint. And no, sir. Is that the same guy that's down here? You idiot. Okay, let me... Let me go in here. What is... What is this? I thought this was the end. This is not... not. Th oh, snap. We gotta buy some stuff. Do whatever you want. Just don't harm another soul. Hmm... You don't look like you can afford what I have for sale. And besides, I am all out of stock. What are you out of stock of? Airships. Since the Sky People destroyed Fox, both the Empire and the Rebellion have been purchasing my ships like crazy. Why don't you only sell to the why do you all, why don't you only sell to the rebels? The Empire will, will only use your ships for evil. If I don't sell to them, they will buy from someone else. Or worse, steal them from me. I don't like it, but it's business. When can we buy an airship and how much? Hard to say. I could sell you my personal one for 30,000 gold. I have enough. I have enough, sir. You suck! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, what was that? This guy sucks. Another silly mission to earn a ship. Not many on Gaia are aware of the former Kingdom of Kennedy. Before the formation of the Empire, there was a fourth kingdom called Kennedy. <laughs> Their king, John F. <laughs> John F. opposed the idea of a global empire to the other three kingdoms within, with the help of the Sky People, destroyed the Kennedy Kingdom. All records of the kingdom were then destroyed. All books referencing the Kennedy Kingdom were burnt by the Ministry of Truth. To this day, it is illegal to possess such knowledge, or to speak John's name. Many moons ago, the Empire took all items from Kennedy's castle, but I believe they missed a secret chamber beneath the throne room. Okay, so let's write this down. So, Kennedy Castle Rune Room. And we need to return this to Lieberland. Okay. Egan folks, the folklore says that an olden item called the JFK Stone was stored in this secret chamber. The JFK Stone has little importance to humans or the Empire, but it holds deep spiritual meaning to us Egans. Here, I have Mark Kennedy Castle on your map. It is at the South Pole. Well, I'm, I'm glad you marked it, sir. If you bring me this stone, I will sell you my personal ship for 30,000 gold. Oh, snap. Do whatever you want. Okay. How much do these even cost? This is like a blimp. 
I'm just curious, like, how much would this cost? We didn't have that, let's say. 30,000, though. That is a lot. That's... We would, we would have, like, 30,000 left, almost. So he marked it on the map. Can I actually view the map now? Let's say... Okay, it's not really showing me the full map. Like I can't I can't see down below. Okay. Sir? What if I view the map in here? Yeah, it's just not showing me the full map for whatever reason. Okay. That was very interesting. Oh no, some of that stuff is even blown out over here. Oh, an alien? Oh wait, I see some anarchy right there. Jiv Jago? Ah, oh, Jiv Jago, that's the uh, developer. A uh, shot, please. No adrenochrome, thank you. I have not used any. Okay. The finest weapons humans used to kill themselves with. I'm pretty sure... Well, this one's actually a little bit better. The dragon staff. I have to see this. That really is any better for Lucy. Or, or this. Dragon helmet. Okay, so there are a, f a few things that I want to get here. Let's give these a try. I just saved, so if something doesn't work out, Dragon Staff for Lucy. Okay. Two. Three. And then four. Let's see what is worthwhile and what isn't. I think it's just for Lucy and Sig. Okay, so that lo raises her, her defense, but it does lower her magic defense. Is that really all that... And that kind of is a bit of a problem, isn't it? Because she takes a lot of damage from, from magic. So, don't get the dragon buckler. But get the dragon staff. Okay, um... Okay, master circlet. I think we already have one, one of those, it looks like. Okay, so that, us uh, reload. So, I already have one of those, so I can actually just equip that. And then we just need the dragon staff. There we go, that increases that. Oh, bye, a lot too. Her magic attack goes up quite a bit. And her magic defense goes up a lot, which is really what she needs. He definitely does. And then for, for Sig, he has this one, which raises a little bit. And that doesn't get rid of any abilities, right? No, it doesn't. Okay. We good. We good. 41,000, though. Ugh. What did we spend a lot? Oh, I guess we spent a lot of money on that shop over there, didn't we? Ugh. Okay, if we ever run out of money, I'll... Find find some way of getting some some money back. Uh, it's okay. I know the Empire a lot about folks. You four are heroes here. My tinker items are much cheaper out here without Imperial taxes. Okay, so sorry to say, sir, we don't need any of this crap. Actually, I would like. You know what? We may not even need to get any more ammo. I just. Stock up on some of that. It's 10, 10, that. Oh. That's not. Let's just buy like two, two boxes. Okay. I just have two on hand. Okay. Okay, we're about to go, go, uh, go, uh, go meet Max. I am programmed to escort customers out of the airship lot. 
If you would like to purchase an airship, please head back to the sales office near the entrance to town behind you. Oh, Max. I'm gonna guess this is Max. I don't know why the heck he's so tiny. Because he's an Egan. That is, that is correct. So let us view some other stuff first. Grrr. Oh, sir, you don't look like you should be in Liberland. You look like a spy. You should just get out of here. Why would anyone want to live in the Empire? No idea. Do whatever you want, just don't harm another soul. Free ocean travel has been banned again. The only way to pass through Imperial Naval checkpoints now is to have a mark or a naval code book. Helps. <laughs> well, we have that. We definitely have that. Ma'am, I would like to talk, talk to you about your... About your stuff. Ma'am? Ma'am! Oh, I, I can't even talk to you. Is this guy a zombie? This guy's a zombie! Yo. He's fake. He should not be here. Deport him, please. If you ever visit Jekyll Island, be sure to go see Edward the Griffin. Yes, I, I have seen Jekyll Island. Thank you so much, sir. I left the rebellion because I don't think war is the answer. Peace is the answer. I defected from the Empire because I because I opened my eye. <laughs> I see. I once lived with the Nadok people. They stay out of war, but I think they have a plan to help. It's interesting how all these people left different things to all come to Lieberland. Okay, Max. Actually, wait, first Max. Uh, Alright, Max. Yes, let's go. I'm Max. How can I help? Mr. Max, we have been sent here by your old friend, General Berwick. He wants to know how we can connect with the ones called the Watchers. Oh, it's been a long time since I have seen Berwick. It was unfortunate that the Sky People destroyed Forks, then gaslighted the public into believing it was your fault. So that, I'm fairly certain, is actually Max Eakin's voice. We here in Lieberland have distanced ourselves from the rebels in the past, but after Forks, we're thinking of rejoining the fight against oppression. Whose side are the Watchers on? The Watchers don't have a side. They serve their master Solomon. They are void of thoughts. They only obey. They're tools of Solomon. So is Solomon a bad guy? Is Solomon on our side? You would have to ask Solomon that. Myth says he is an ancient god or demon, depending on who you talk to. The people who know the most of this myth live out in the Sidonian Desert. They are called the Knights of Sidonia, an ancient religion based around Solomon. Max, will the people of Liberland join the rebellion? We plan to discuss this at our next People's Assembly. Tell Berwick that from now on, we are separate, but Lieberland public support is shifting towards joining the fight. Return to tell Berwick that he is welcome to attend our next People's Assembly, where he can ask the people of Lieberland directly himself. Okay, thank you, Max. Okay, so I guess that is our new mission objective then, right? Squad must return to inform Berwick that he is welcome to the Lieberland People's Assembly. Okay. Well, before we do that, we got to go to the uh, JFK castle to get the... What was that thing called? The JFK amulet or something? I think the people of Lieberland are starting to realize that we can't stay neutral forever. What was the name of that? Uh, it was like the JFK stone. Let me see. The JFK stone, yes. And that costs 30000 That basically wipes out all of our money. It sucks. I used up... I got so much... How, how could we even deal with it if, if we got, you know, so many freedom rings past halfway? I guess this doesn't do anything. That's uh, really upsetting. <laughs> oh, and I see Ryan has joined us. You'll be looking for a bit nursing a headache. Well, I hope your headache feels a little bit better. Maybe, maybe once, once we get the JFK stone, it'll, it'll help you out a bit. We're gonna go do that right now. Go get that JF, JFK stone. Oh wait, first we gotta get that treasure. I don't, I don't, 
I don't know what that is. Where's that treasure area? This is a naval check checkpoint. Imperial checkpoint. Submitting code now. It's an older code, but it checks out. You're clear to pass. Thank you, sir. Okay, Sidonia Village. I think it was on Sidonia that that the that the um thing was on, right? This wasn't it, right? Was it? That is it. Sidonia is a Star Wars reference? Oh, see, I had no idea. I I knew H Hoth was. Oh, what is this? Tambora. Tom, is, is, is this a Star Wars reference? I don't know if I want to go here yet. This looks fiery and dangerous. Let's just wait on that. I believe this is the island that had the treasure on it. And then we'll go to JFK Island. Well, this looks horrible. Oh, it was the older code, but it checks out. Ah, from uh, Return of the Jedi. Interesting. That's really fascinating. Okay, I'm not going to fight these fools. I'm just going to avoid them. Ah, uh, I, I bought some hand hand grenades. I shouldn't have bought them. Uh, these guys are blocking my way. You know what, guys? I'm going to use a hand grenade on you so I can actually just u use one up. So I'm going to pick it up. Let's see what stupid enemies are here. What are these fools? Oh, it's just you. I don't even need to bother. Ugh. Here, old in hand, hand grenade, please. Take, take that, man. Here, and then you're stunned. I want that treasure, though. There you go. A lot of weird stuff here. It's like everything this is all like broken and everything. Okay. Nothing is interactable here. Oh. Uh, I really want that JFK stone. That is something that I'm really excited to get. Like an abandoned town. Oh, there's some anarchy down there. Oh, sir, I did not want to attack, attack you, but it's fine. Ah, you actually packed quite a punch, sir. Sir? There you go. Okay, sir, please leave. Thank you. I would like this anarchy. Thank you so very much. I really hope we can get them all. I really hope that we have, we're not going to miss any. But that's certainly a possibility. Ten blast rounds. I don't think we really needed that. Okay. I'll take out these fools. Get away. Time for us to collect your bounty. Oh no, we're being ambushed. Oh great. Are you coming peacefully? Leave now, or we will hurt you. Oh, it's like every bad guy in the game. Okay. We haven't even seen some of these guys. We haven't seen the... Okay, so the guys we have not seen are is let's say we haven't seen this one, goons. We haven't seen the bandit. We've seen him. The Obama gangers. We've seen him. We've seen him. We've seen him, and we haven't seen him. The bounty hunter. Okay, my guess is that probably the bounty hunter is going to be. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? Back out of that. Do battle cry, and then attack. Lucy, do flame. Sig, attack him on with that, and then do a strong attack on goons. There you go. 
No, this, this is the spot to use the Odin hand grenade. Why didn't I do that? I'm gonna do that on my next next turn. I really hope that uh, they don't kill me though. He's probably the strongest guy, him. Although I don't know what these other guys are capable of. Okay, never mind. Maybe we don't throwing stones. Oh gosh. You want to throw some stones too, man? Okay, now we're gonna use. Lucy, you you use the fire again. Sig, I want you to use the Odin hand grenade. There you go. And you know what? You use first aid on Sig. There you go. Nice, nice. Okay, so yeah, the, the bounty hunter, just as I thought, he does seem to be the strongest guy here. Let's just do a quake. Um, standard attack, standard attack, there you go. Okay, the, the bounty hunter's dead. He, he, was like, he was like the boss, I guess, the ringleader. Thousand gold, that helps. Lucy's now level 21, good. Alright, you stupid bounty hunters. You got nothing on me, man. You got nothing on me. I'm, I'm getting this treasure whether you like it or not. Uh, okay, I see how to get that. This is like a vacant town. It's interesting. Super potion. Okay, thank you. All right, let's head on down here. We got to get this treasure. Okay, so basically it was just go all the way down here and go like... There it is. Oh, yo, look at all this gold. Yes, the jackpot. We definitely need to replenish. Okay, so we have 39.6. 62,000 now. And a freedom ring. And a lucky ring. Oh, that was the jackpot right there. Okay, so now we have a lot of money. Lucky ring. A ring that increases luck. I think I am going to put that on him as well as opposed to the TP one. Maybe Lucy. Actually, she has this. This is really, really good for her. Yeah, I'm gonna put I put the luck on. I think that just makes it so he's able to land and attack more frequently, maybe, but Oh, that was the amazing jackpot right there. Okay, so I'm glad that that, that we that we came here to get all that amazing gold. That gold was sick. I mean we had to go through this desolate vacant town in order to get to it, but Yep, save it again. Okay, now it's time to head to JF JFK Castle. Oh, John F, we're coming down to see ya. Okay, so we can go into here now. Move along, sir. Great Pacific Garbage Patch. Oh, this is it. Castle Kennedy. There, uh, there it is. The castle... What the heck is this? Curious that this place is blocked out on an, the Imperial map we have. This is where the Sky People grow their food. It's all chemically lab-grown. It is also where they detain those who dare to use their minds. Yeah, you know, that... that seems about right. That seems about... about right. Oh, there's, there's like a, uh, sh a shipwreck here. Oh no. This is the SS Irwin. General Burwick sent them on a mission to stop the Wow Thing poaches a few months ago. This is horrible. Let's search around. In the shipwreck, the party finds a magical item. Ocean Warrior Kerchief. Okay, I cannot see what, of, what, of what that is, but... I see some dolphins here or something. 
Burwick? Ricky Burwick? No, this is uh, Jeff Burwick of the Dollar Vigilante. The anarchist himself. That's 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 how I found out about this game because I watch him. So, hmm. Oh, it is so good to see you. We have another subsidy to buy bigger nets. These waters are getting harder to fish. You are with the Ministry, aren't you? With the Ministry of Truth? No. No. Leave the Walfins alone, Buster. Our Walfin meat is labeled Walfin safe. They love it. Don't get in our way, punks. Okay, you know what? I gotta say first. Let's see what that her chiff thing is that we got. Probably an item we can uh, equip. Ocean Warrior Kerchief. Magically and physically protects and regenerates the wearer. Five attack. Oh. This may be something Lucy should be wearing. Oh, look at her magic defense though. Her defense goes up a lot. Everything else goes down slightly. What does the Horn of Z's do? HP plus 100 MP. So that does lower that. But the fact that uh, it regenerates her health and gives her um, a lot of magic defense. She has to wear it. Um, anything else, I guess, that is Horn of Z's? Increases agility, strength. Yeah, he definitely should be wearing that. What about Ring of Toxic Protection? He can't actually wear the Ring of Z's guard ring, though. I don't think I want to wear, wear that, though. And then Dan Dix, I don't think, can equip it. No. Okay. So it's this little bit of a different setup. She has a little bit less health and magic now, but I think it may be worth it to regenerate her health. Okay, sir. We're going to board, and then we're going to go Castle Kennedy. The Walfins Fisher. There you go. Oh, you guys are gonna suck hard, aren't you? And by suck hard, I mean you're you you you're, you're gonna be easy to, to defeat. You know, Odin hand grenade. There you go. And now you're stunned. So I guess Rudy now attacks first. Okay, okay. Yes. Lucy regenerates a lot of health. Oh, that'd be great if she regenerated her MP. Oh my gosh, that would be amazing if she, if she did regenerate her MP. Okay, do that. Sig, just do that. And then slash. Okay, okay. I oh know, these, these guys do seem a bit tough. Yeah, they have a lot of, uh, health. A lot of health. That's how much damage that they end up doing. Oh, oh barely any. Now. Barely any damage. Oh, come, come now. I don't think that's how you talk, sir, but if you want to talk like that, that's perfectly fine. Fine by me. Okay, okay. There you go. One is finally dead. There you go. Increase our attack. Two are now dead. No way you can defeat me. No way you can defeat me. Uh, sure, 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 sir. Just gonna do normal attacks for the rest of these fools. You ain't worth worth my time. Okay, wow. To resist potion increase. Resistance increase potions and 4,000 gold. There you go. You leave. Yeah, you better run. Nice. Okay, so... What are the things that, that we got? We got resistance increase. Magic defense. Okay, so who's in need of that? 142. 
191, 156. Oh, definitely Rudy. Rudy's like sucking now. Give this to a Rudy. There you go, Rudy. Hopefully that increases some of your stats a bit. Magic defense, barely anything. I mean, he has a good, a good attack, but still. Castle Kennedy. Okay, I think this is our way to how we get get to Castle Kennedy. Yeah. Oh no, we actually have to go. Yeah. Okay. Is there anything secret here? It'd be interesting if there's like another s secret. No, okay. Alright, Castle Kennedy time. No, I don't want to... Not, not the telly box. Ugh. Alright, let's defeat this darn telly box. Can't stand the tel telly box. Yeah. Please don't affect me at all, sir. Good. You missed! You missed! This tele box has a scrotum as a smile. Yeah, that, that is what I was thinking as well. The <laughs> tele box. <laughs> the tele box. Oh, here it is. Castle Kennedy. I'm excited. Okay, there is a very grave danger that the announced need for increased security will be seized upon by those anxious to expand its meaning to the very... Limits of official censorship and concealment. John F. Kennedy. Okay, we gotta find the the K Kennedy orb or whatever. Oh, the music. This is like like the, the best music here. Gate locked. All the writing on the stone plague has been. She Chiseled away, destroying what history la laid here. Alright, I, I, I have to show sure, a sure, moment. This music is great. <laughs> darn it, you were interrupting the, the music, you darn gold diggers. Wait, um, no, Lucy's the one who can, actually, wait, Lucy can just do this one. There you go. Yeah, I find that music to be, like, very, like, calm and relaxing. Now, it says he can't steal our gold anymore because we're wearing the Ma Masonic ring. I don't know how true that actually is. I know you like gold, you suck. Thank you. Okay. How many freedom rings do we have now? We're just... 73. How much did we end up getting? Okay, so we're like 35 away. That is amazing. I like that. We have to get them all. We have to. A lot of treasures here. Move it, penguins. You're kind of blocking a treasure. Over there. Oh, wait, no. This is inside of the castle, it looks like. Yeah, we have to somehow get inside the, uh, the castle. Another freedom ring. Okay, penguins, you're finally out of out of my way. Four hundred gold. Okay, so look, we could we could get we could open that treasure chest without going up on the on the roof. Perfectly fine. Is there any way up here to like sneakily get up here somehow? No. Okay. 
Okay, open that treasure chest from the opposite side. That was great. I liked that. This place is pretty large, isn't it? Another freedom ring. Kennedy Key. Yes, we can finally go in inside now. What the heck is this? Yo. This ain't right. I don't know what that is, but I don't- I don't like that. I don't like that thing back- uh, back there. At all. That thing is way too big. Please don't kill me. Oh my gosh. Lucy can regenerate her health though, so that's- that's excellent. Okay. Sig, I want you to use... Sacred mu uh, mu Mushroom, please. And then Slash on all of them. It's a, man it's a, it's a Manticore? Yeah, it's, it's evil. Whatever the heck it is. This thing is... Ugh. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> I thought it was going to be way harder. No. Alright. Not that much experience for gold either, which kind of sucked, but... Hmm, such nice, relaxing music. I like very, very much. From the Greek my mythology, it's a feline with an insect tail. Oh. Fascinating. Penguins, please move. Thank you. Let me save it, just in case we we're going to get ambushed again. Iron breastplate, I don't think that is of any value whatsoever. No. Not even for Ru Rudy, right? No. I don't like that they give us just garbage. Okay, well, it looks like we're going into the K Kennedy Castle now. There's nothing else up here, right? There is some sort of pathway up there, but okay. Head inside the uh, castle and get the K Kennedy orb now. Oh gosh. This looks a bit spooky. Oh, a sacred motion. Perfect. I, I, I just used use one up. Okay, let's fight these enemies. Let's see what they are. Yo, what the heck is this? A snow snake? Colonel, it's me. I, this is what happens when I uh, get frozen in Kennedy Castle. Snake. 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 Get, get, get rid of this fool. There you go. Uh, he, he was easy. I guess because of something else that I equipped on Dan Dix. What did I do differently? Oh, it's because I did the lucky ring as opposed to the TP... The TP charge rate. That means he doesn't have like two attacks to any anymore. You know what? I think I'm going to put uh, put that back uh, back on him. Because he he was able to do like two attacks last time. I don't think he's, he's able, to, able to do that any anymore. Okay. And I'd rather have that. Okay. And as usual, I will come here on my own time and, and defeat the enemies. We're just here to explore. Oh, what is this? That's interesting. 
I think we need to get the second crystal to sit on this button. Hmm. There's another crystal here we can end up getting. Okay. Oh no, it's, it's, the, it's the Rona infested rat. You better be careful. Oh. Okay, I think I kind of screwed that up. I think I screwed it up. Okay. Let's, um... We can move that crystal over there. So we have to do this. This goes up to the rooftop. I know that. Which you already got the treasure chest. Oh wait, look. You can't. You can't even even a a. Okay, I was about to say. Nothing else of value here, right? Ah. Okay. Yeah, it looks like that is just all that we have to do. We have to move this crystal now. No, you, you moved too, too far there, bud. There you go. There you go. No, you're going the wrong, wrong, wrong way. There you go, there you go. Careful of the Rona infested rat. You don't want to be infected. Okay, so we want to bring it down from uh, from here. Careful of the Rona. At least it's moving the correct way. Okay, let's save it again, just in case. There we go. Did it open the portal to the basement? Yes! Yes! Okay, I don't I don't like that terminator guy. That's that's down here. Okay. Oh, it's just you, sir. You're not that big of a problem. Hey look, he can attack twice, yeah. I don't think he could do that when he had the uh luck ring on, so maybe maybe he could, I just wasn't paying attention, who knows? Sometimes that happens, you know? Sometimes it'd be like that. All good. Oh. But she regenerates! Oh, that was a nice, be a beefy amount of damage. <clears throat> Uh, all you fools just continue to do no normal attacks. I should be doing magic with Lucy though, but I don't want to waste her MP, but I guess I, I should. There you go. Three three thousand gold. Okay, good. We're getting a lot of gold now. Got it. The JFK stone. Sweet. Okay. Well, 
I think this is probably where we're going to stop now. Uh, next time... Actually, first, let's uh, view the item description for the JFK stone. We got the Kennedy key. Uh, JFK stone, a spiritual artifact that holds significant meaning to the Egan peoples. We got 75 of these. Oh, just like 33 left. Very, very nice. So once we get the helicopter, we can really go a lot of places. So that'll really open up a lot of stuff for us. So. Yeah, that's just, uh, be in suspense for next, next, next time. So, yeah, next time on Rebellion Gaia, we're going to head back to the Egan peoples. We're going to be able to get that helicopter for how much money will we have left? Like 40,000? A, a decent amount of money left still. Okay, you know. And then we're going to be able to fly around and maybe we'll find some nice places to go. So, yeah, I will see you next time on Rebellion Gaia.